In honor of Finland's Independence Day, Kat has created a quiz for me. Now we have done a quiz over on this channel before. I believe it was called the Ultimate Finland Quiz or I Ultimate so. Finnish Quiz yeah. or something. Mm. And you guys seem to enjoy that. So here we are for another quiz. Now this will be the ultimate quiz. That'll be... This will be the world's best Finland quiz. Okay. No like pressure it. on me. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but there's a huge difference between that quiz and this one because that was a year and a half ago. True. And was it a year and a half yeah, ago? Yeah, oh it was. God. I watched it today. <laughs> it was in the summer of 2017 and we had no idea we were moving to Finland. That's true, yeah. We'd just been visiting here and there, summers and stuff. Yeah. Now we live here, so I should do a lot better than what I did then. You really should. I can't remember how well I did then. Not great. Okay. <laughs> Talk us through this, because I have no idea what Kat has arranged for me today. We have four different categories. Mm -hmm. The categories are culture, mm -hmm. business, oh. nature, uh -huh. and then we've got a secret category oh. that will not be revealed until we get to it. Okay. Each category has three questions, mm -hmm. and I will be as lenient and forgiving as I wish. <laughs> Okay. Basically. <laughs> All right, cool. Please play along with me and let us know your score in the comments. Hopefully I can beat you all. <laughs> I doubt I will. Are you ready? I'm ready. The category is culture. Question number one. Which American actor has had his own Finnish talk show? David Hasselhoff. Very good. Yes! What show was it? Do you know? Uh, I think it was called the Hasselhoff Show or David Hasselhoff Finland, something like that. Very good, good start. All right, one point Confidence. on the board, one out of one. Which best-selling author was inspired by the Finnish national epic Kalevala? Was it J.K. Rowling who wrote Harry Potter? <laughs> I know this. Oh, do you not even want the... It's Tolkien, Lord okay, of the Rings. Fine. Because he based Elvish around the Finnish language. Ah, okay, so that was an extra, okay, so you just knew that randomly. Mm. Okay, that is another point for you, sir. But I have a feeling this lucky streak is about to be over. <laughs> All right, bring it on. What is the name of Finland's national musical instrument? National musical instrument. It is a instrument that has its origin in Finland. Okay, can you give me a clue? No. No, I don't know. What is it's it? It's called kantele. It's one of these like wooden boards with strings and then ding, ding, okay. ding, 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 What is the name of the company that created Angry Birds? Rovio. Next. What did Nokia manufacture before mobile phones? Wellington boots or rubber boots. Very good. What is the Finnish company name visible on escalators and elevators all over the world? Is it, is it just Hissi? Or is that... It's not the company name. Okay, no. good to know. Oh, no, we had one in our last apartment, didn't we? G just give me one clue. Give me the first letter. Okay, but you're not going to get a point for it. Half a point. K. K. Oh, no. You'll hate yourself when you hear I it. I know I will. Pass. Kone. Kone. Dang it! That's annoying. Moving on. The category is nature. We all know that Finland is the land of a thousand lakes. Mm-hmm. But pray tell, how many islands are there in Finland? This is any kind of islands, like islands overall, the amount. It doesn't matter how big or small, how many islands. Take a wild guess if you don't know. Ballpark figure, 180 something thousand lakes, 100,000. Almost 180,000, almost as many as the lakes. Okay, so I got that wrong, but 100, you should have really specified like how many I could be here or there, but. Whatever. I'm not sure if I agree with these rules. Well, take it up with the complaint board. How long is it between sunset and sunrise in Lapland on June 1st? We don't need an exact amount. We need, we want a ballpark. Okay. Within like 10 minutes? A small ballpark. Between sunrise and sunset on June, mm. June something. Okay. So how long is it dark? Two hours. Very good. Is that exact? An hour and 53 minutes. Hey -o. That was good for an absolute guess. Yeah. Last nature related question. Mm -hmm. Which animal is Finland's national animal? Mm -hmm. Well, the lion is on the crest. Lion. Incorrect. What? But do you want to take another Bear. guess? Yeah. But why is it on the crest then? Like the hockey shirt but and all that. No, but we don't have lions. And they're called the Finnish lions, no? Yeah. 
Uh, but we don't have lions here, so it can't really be our national animal. Hmm. I need to, uh, something else I need to take up with the, the board of complaints. Apparently. Yeah, definitely. Mm. Last category. Mm -hmm. Surprise category. All right. The category is Dave Katz, Finland. Ooh. These are questions based on information retrieved from your YouTube videos. Okay. Wow. You've actually put some effort into this. Which Finnish food that Dave Katz said divides the nation was according to Eetu, Ed Speaks, five out of five. Food that divides the nation. It's not going to be the obvious, is it? Maxilatico? Maxilatico, final answer. That's wrong. Would you like to try again? <sighs> what food divides the nation? Particularly because of the sound. Leipajusto. Yeah. Eetu gave it five out of five. Yeah, you gave it a three out of five in the video. Ah, yeah. okay. Next question. All right. What is, according to Dave Cad, some of the biggest differences between England and Finland? Okay, how many do I need to name? We're looking at three. Three, okay. Separate duvets, having flushable toilet rolls, and languages? You got one out of three there. What? Because we were actually looking for things like that people don't say hello to each other on the street. Mm. In, in Finland as opposed to in England and also the weather. <laughs> okay, the Dave Cad round was actually my worst. <laughs> yeah, uh, there's one more. Oh, okay. Yeah. Which Finnish alcohol did Dave Cad describe as tingly, quite interesting and really not that bad? Tingly, quite interesting. It's either Mintu or Valhalla. No, I didn't like Valhalla that was whatsoever. Mintu. Incorrect. Tingly. It is Yussi 69 chili ah, licorice shot. <laughs> tingly. I think I did this. Tingly. Yeah, probably. <laughs> but then we have a final bonus question. Oh. This man. bonus question is, is carried on from the previous quiz. Oh no. One that you couldn't answer then, but now, having lived in Finland for nine months, you surely will be able to answer. Okay. Dave Cad. Who is the president of Finland? Sauli Niinistö. Wow! Well done! Didn't you think I was going to get that? No! I thought you were going to be horribly embarrassed. You're probably going to cut it out. I don't know why I should be giving, yeah, giving you that very, much credit. But yeah, I'm very excited anyway, about that. Yeah, your Dave Cad round was the worst. Mm. Um, but it shows that your general knowledge of Finland is quite good. Mm, and that I'm not really so self obsessed exactly you don't watch your own videos on the daily i'm so modest so you got six out of 12 you got half of them right okay and to be fair some of them were tricky okay yeah i'm a little bit disappointed but i'll take it half half right so that is about it guys don't forget to let us know your score in the comments down below hopefully you did better than i did because i did terribly i would be super interested if anyone actually got the david cad questions right yeah. <laughs> like even one if you even got one that would be quite impressive slash creepy so that is about it for today guys thank you so much for watching this video if you have enjoyed it hit that like button don't forget to go and check out cat's channel as well there'll be links down below and in the cards up above but with all that said all that is left to say is happy finnish independence day coming up on when is it sixth happy finnish independence day happy birthday finland so once again guys thank you so much for watching and we'll see you again next time see ya bye